All right, we are back with more Factorio. Here we go. I am Pax, and we are continuing the playthrough of SpaceX. And we are just racing, racing through the green science. And I've started to lay out um, a bit more of the next stage of the hub. Um, and so uh, the idea is partly that we want to build some of the power and water buildings. Um, and um, then we also want to kind of maybe build some green circuits and the things that need green circuits. And uh, I think the idea was then, I think I'm gonna get um, kind of green circuits and steel coming in through on this lane and um, feed all the things that need green circuits over here. Um, and we'll need more things that like eventually need steel later. And um, so then, yeah, it'd be nice to have some um, you know, fast inserters, so I kind of squeezed it in right here, and um, let's see, I think um, I still kind of want everything to be on that side, so I'm kind of thinking about, uh, you know, I, yeah, I just want, you know, all these to, um, yeah, so let's just, um, let's just do it like this then. And what else? You need iron plates as well. Um, so we'll just do this. And um, okay, so then let's just build some green circuits. And I think yeah, we're just gonna do the uh, standard uh, Factorio green circuits build. Um, yeah, so like that seems good. <clears throat> Something like that, I guess. And uh, now, like this, yes. Um, so in SpaceX, actually, the green circuits don't. Whoops. The green circuits use uh, stone instead of iron. Uh, so I think that's actually pretty nice um, in terms of uh, just keeping the game a bit balanced and. Um, so then um, we will just set this up uh, and let's see, uh, I think then, yeah, the stone needs, where is it here, stone tablets, yeah, so uh, so yeah, then the ratio is 6 to 4 to 1, I think uh, this gives you the full ratio, and for the stone tablets I'm going to use the loaders and um, and then just have both inputs and outputs um, over here. So uh, yeah. So then we'll do the um, power poles like this. Uh, okay. And then we'll go uh, input, output, output, input, input, output, output, input. And um, all right. And then I think I'm going to use this little trick here uh, to. So if, if you put a belt sideways onto a um, underground like this, only one side will go through, the bottom side gets blocked. And this should then allow us to, um, yes, have, um, wow, this is very close, but it's okay, not a big deal really. Okay, that should get us some green circuits, and yes, and then, yeah, the idea will be like, we'll put steel on the other side of the belt, and we'll bring it down through here and set up the green circuits and then we'll bring the copper back as well and use it to make uh, these uh, copper cables. Um, and yes, so then the hope is that we can build then all of these uh, circuit types of things and um, so let's just see how far this gets us. Um, so hopefully that's just, yeah, this will at least get, yeah, here the green circuits are coming. Uh, we might need some fast inserters as well, so uh, yes. Um, actually, we can just go ahead and start building some. Do we get our filter inserters? Yes. So then we also want these uh, filter inserters. And um, yeah, they'll go just fine right here. And they need uh, more green circuits as well. <clears throat> And then the idea is that, yes, we'll put the uh, copper cables out here. Let's see, can we get some fast inserters? Now yeah, I got some, good. Uh, you need like even more iron, it looks like. Um, and yes, 
okay. Uh, so yeah, we'll probably just start using fast inserters now. And um, let's see, then you want also some iron. Uh, so we'll just have you output iron sticks and some iron. Is that fast enough? Yeah. Cool. And then now let's see. Okay, so uh, now you need uh, the iron sticks and and the copper cable. So that's fine. And we'll feed you. And yeah, I might as well just move the uh, power poles over to here. Whatever, it's fine. Um, Okay, you'll need steel, so you can't do anything right now. And but then, yeah, these other guys again. I think uh, we'll have this. Uh, actually, I don't know. Maybe like this, I guess. Uh, it doesn't matter. Okay, and then let's see. Yeah, cables and circuits. So basically, yeah, just going to be uh, cables, 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 cables. Cables and circuits, 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 circuits. Uh, so we'll think about that a little bit. Um, uh, yeah, cool. Okay, that seems good. And eventually, yeah, we'll have steel, so then this will. Uh, also, you know, grab the steel uh, and the cables. Oops. Uh, so, yeah, eventually we'll get steel in here. And let's see. So then I think all these things. Oh no. Okay, yeah. And then we can do, uh, I guess, these guys. <clears throat> let's see how we want this. This. Just say it like this. Seems good. Um, so then, greens and iron. <clears throat> um, okay, well that's a start. And then let's also uh, get some of these uh, water buildings built that we are going to want for electricity and things like that. Um, so this only needs, okay, you need, uh, okay, you need to go there. Then you need electric motors and you need iron. And you need iron for gears. And we'll get an output. Um, yeah, this one, yeah, we're gonna need a lot of these. So let's get, like, yeah. Let's, they only stack to 10, so we need a lot of them. Okay, let's get now, okay, so the plan here is then to build lots of pipes and have a lane of pipes, more or less. Um, so we're starting this lane of pipes here, and then we'll continue the uh, stone and such. And yeah, I was hoping to have this mine out of the way. Uh, I knew that this was going to get in the way, but a good amount of it's gone already, so it's almost out of the way. Just got to get a couple more things uh, finished. And um, okay, and then there was, um, yeah, so we want to also build um, over here, we can build also boilers. Yeah, so I think boilers need um, furnaces. So that was just the idea here. And a boiler. And they just need pipes. Uh, so yeah, it should be easy. Um, so we'll bring uh, the stone there. And we will bring the pipes in here. And uh, just put it on the output side over here. And boilers, yeah, stacking to one is good. Um, so now, yeah, okay, good. We got the turbines, we got the boilers coming. Uh, we next want um, these guys. And uh, let's see, 10 pipes and five irons. 
Should I... I could double down, but... Nah, no, no worries. Um, okay, so then uh, one trick is going to be... Um, okay, so yeah, we have this mod, and uh, it allows us to build these buildings called Deep Water Wells. I think the mod's called Stone Water Wells, but basically this is just a building that gives you free water. And uh, I think it's better than water fill because um, it, um, you know, doesn't... Well, water fill can obviously break the biters, uh, so that can be one problem with water fill. Um, okay, and then, but then we, it needs so many different things. Um, so actually, um, let's move this here. Um, okay, so then, yeah, we're going to bring these underground pipes. It needs underground pipes, so we're going to bring these over. And then it needs stone bricks. Uh, so we pull that in. And stone, so yeah, that'll give us stone bricks and stone. Um, so maybe even... Hmm, maybe I want to go like this. Double that up. And then now we need these guys. So yeah, these guys need uh, the electric engines and they need the pipes. So we'll do it like this, I guess. And then we will feed these into here. And then I guess um, I would like everything to point on this side, but yeah, it's looking not too possible for that. Um, let's also not have too many of these buffer up. 400, 800 is like pretty, pretty absurd actually. Okay, so I, I guess I'll just put them on the inside then. Um, and okay, yeah, so yeah, so this, this is a stone water well. It's just like a big five by five building that gives you water. And um, I think, yeah, it's like a good way to get free water, but um, and not do like all the pump and water pipe logistics stuff. Um, and it's better than waterfall because yeah, I can't break the biters, you can't build a moat. Um, and sort of the, the price of the free water is like, at least you have this, you have to deal with this like pretty large building. Um, but what's also nice about the, the stone water wells is that they can um, uh, do really well with just um, put it being put in blueprints and getting copied and things like that. So, um, so that's always yeah kind of nice. Um, I feel like should I speed this up? All right, let's see if that. Well, like, it just eats it all, right? But, uh, oh well, I guess. Okay, yeah, so then, yeah, there we go. Okay, we got the boilers, we got the pipes, we got water wells, we got pumps. We got a lot of train stuff coming. We got a lot of our circuit stuff coming. We have our fast inserters, and we have um, more green circuits now. So, um, very exciting. And uh, perhaps we can, yeah, I don't know. I'm trying to ditch some of these extra inserters here. And, um, can I do this? Yeah, let's just try to ditch some of these. Cool. All right, well then uh, I think this will be a good place to take a break. And uh, yeah, we got all the way up to military science. Um, so we'll probably just finish up a couple of last researches. Um, and I think, um, yeah, we want the LTN and Probably the only thing that's also worth uh, going for is to get then these, um, oh, well, mining productivity isn't bad. I was wanting this and this, and then eventually the this bonus too. Um, that will upgrade all of our inserters to have carry twice as much, which will double our uh, inserter capacity. So um, yeah. Then um, until next time, we will uh, catch back up when uh, probably building steel and uh, continuing to expand the hub uh, to get the kind of fluid buildings and the last part of 
last couple of things we need for trains and um and then yeah we want to build some trains and some cars and start uh figuring out what to do in that kind of stage of the base and um, start getting trains going but yeah that'll do it for this session there you go factorio i'm pax and see you in the next video